Hey there folks, a long time ago I asked you all what random ass metagames you guys wanted me to play and then I ignored your suggestions because what I wanted to play was Gen 1. So I played that, I lost terribly, and then I said that I wanted a Gen 3 contest. No one took me up on that offer of a Gen 3 contest, and I was trying to figure out what the hell I was going to do when Zabuza of the Water, who'd massacred me twice in Little Cup, PM me and was like, Hey, do you want to do Little Ubers? For those of you who don't know, Little Ubers is Ubers played at level 5. So it's supposed to be the most hyper-offensive, crazy awesome game ever, and that's what we're playing. I really expected Extreme Speed to dominate and uh, Focus Sash to really be everywhere. And Focus Sash is everywhere, but Extreme Speed, as you can see, doesn't really dominate. This is a Rayquaza named Little Aztec who is not banded, it's Sash, because, as I said, Sash dominates. You'll notice that he has a spinner, I have a Magic Bouncer. So really, the aim of the game is don't let your opponent set up rocks. I don't even have someone to try to set up rocks on my team. So he goes out into his which I'm Fortress as I go for the extreme speed, break his sturdy, and now I'm going to be able to go for a V-Create, and that's totally awesome. Now you may be like, Antar, shiny Rayquaza can't have V-Create. I'm like, this is Little Ubers, who the f*** cares? Oh, I said a bad word, sorry about that. So, uh, yeah, Equalizer is down, and I don't have to worry about him setting up rocks, and my Rayquaza is kicking ass and taking names. Gonna want to switch out here, because I am at minus one of everything. Although I think, I mean, I have the Sash, I could take him out with an Earthquake, I guess. I was expecting him to just protect and then have High Jump Kick, I guess, as his primary attacking move, but no, no, he went for the Shadow Claw, somehow predicting my move, I have no idea how. Maybe he thought I was gonna go out on an Espeon and hit him with a Psychic, I don't know. But, Little Durak is going to die, and that is sad pandas. So, Blaziken is now at like plus two, three, who cares. That's okay, Little Aztec can extreme speed it for the win. Uh, Weather, neither of us is... He actually doesn't have weather. I don't have weather. I was surprised that not, neither of us had weather teams in Little Ubers. So he's just getting his speed up as high as he can. And I'm thinking, why are you doing that? I'm faster than... You're already faster than me. It really doesn't matter. And then I see he goes through a baton pass. And I message him and I'm like, you know baton pass and speed boost are illegal, right? And he's like, oh, they are? It's like, yeah, it's a, and it's a breed move. But you know what? It's Little Ubers. Who gives a damn? Uh, knowing that uh, even the extreme speed from him wouldn't do that much, plus he's faster, I decided to go for Outrage. Uh, get him down to his Sash. Sash is everywhere in this game. Unfortunately, I'm locked into Outrage extreme speed. Two extreme speeds would have been the better move. But alas, I'm going to die. And bye bye, Rayquaza. You did great work. Now I go out into Little Yahweh. Go for the extreme speed. I guess he knew that extreme speed wouldn't do too much to me, so that's why he didn't go for it himself. Take out his Deoxys, and that's one of the big threats. And I, even though the score is pretty close, oh, it's what, four, five right now? I'm feeling like I'm dominating. So, I'm gonna switch out here into Little Suki, my Espeon, because I not sh I kind of a death fodder if he went for a Draco Meteor, but also I just wanted to set up screens because I figured this guy really wouldn't be menacing without screens, but as you see, I kind of played this a little bit wonky. He goes for another Dragon Pulse. Not, I guess, maybe he doesn't carry the... He's Life Orb, so not exactly sure what's going on there, why he's not here to switch it out for a different move. But I go out into my Deoxys, knowing that he's still got the Draco Meteor, and even with the... even with the... Uh, screen up, I'm not sure how that's going to fare, so I go for the superpower knowing I can take him out because I'll be faster, he's not scarfed or anything, so that is a dead Curum White, and too overpowered for you? I think not. So he's going to go out now into his extreme speeding Rayquaza, because of course it's an extreme speeding Rayquaza. He's going to go for extreme speed, I am going to go for, for Psycho Boost because I'm sashed, he's probably sashed, I figure I'm faster, go, unless he's scarfed. I go for the Psycho Boost, and then I go for the Extreme Speed, and I get the kill, and that should work out great. So, I'm now at minus one uh, attack, minus two special attack, and I should probably be switching out at some point, but you know what? Deoxys is so much of a champ that I think, hey, maybe I don't need to. He goes out into his Blaziken. He's actually a little bit upset that he's not going to really get to show off the set so much, 
And uh, we're messaging back and forth, and he's a little bit sad about the fact that his Blaziken isn't going to get to do much in this match. And uh, we work something out for the last turn that you'll see. So he goes ahead and sends out Smeargle here, basically as... Actually, I'm not sure why. Dev Fodder? Maybe he thought he could take the extreme speed? No idea why he sweat, went out into Smeargle. But what's going to happen now is that I'm going to switch out into my Dialga so that he can show off the last move on his set. So I'd won this game because an extreme speed would have killed him, but I go ahead and let him even it up a little bit just to show off the fact that his optional, his Blaziken has Reversal, which is a really great move and it's going to net him the KO against Little Albert. Uh, it's too bad my Dialga didn't get to actually do anything in this battle. Yeah, so basically the idea there is that if Extreme Speed is going to dominate the metagame, then someone who resists Extreme Speed is probably going to be great. Uh, that's also why I have my uh, uh, Giratina O to block the Extreme Speed. I take him out with an Extreme Speed here, and as you saw, Little Uber is not as hyper-offensive as I thought it would be in the sense that Extreme Speed really doesn't dominate, or Extreme Speed really doesn't kill everyone. So. Kind of interesting. Hope you folks enjoyed that little Ubers battle. If you guys want to, if any of you want to have a Gen 3 Pokemon contest with me, I would love that because that's what I want to upload next time around. Although that's not going to be for months. So anyway, comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge. So long.